at the hotel, that was an experience. I've cried twice already because it was just so magical. I'm like overwhelmed how beautiful that was. Totally worth it. And the sanctuary was so clean. I mean, I was kind of expecting to be like smelly or something. The toilets would be bad. Everything was sparkling, literally like sparkling. So, yes, thank you. Oh, he just picked us up, the song that we were walking. You know that song from Pocahontas? Can you even see me? Anyways, there's a song in Pocahontas from my, um, my grandmother Willow. It's like, listen with your heart, you will understand. Girl, I was just singing that the whole time in my head. I was just like, oh my goodness, so beautiful. I can't deal with this. But yeah, we're gonna go to dinner now. I'm just, uh, life is complete, straight up after some elephants. So I've been seeing Thai pancakes everywhere. Like almost every stand is like selling backpacks, dresses, sandals, bikinis, and then you have the next shop which is like a tailor. There's so many tailors here. And then next shop is like a restaurant, and then the next shop is like ice cream with like Thai pancakes and stuff right here. So I wanna try it. We're gonna try it now. Put some sugar on it. That's basically tortilla. It's okay. I'm gonna still eat it. So we're at the orchid bar now. It's kind of at the beginning of the road at Kamala Beach. It's got a, a drink and I just wanted to call it a night um, and also tell you that tomorrow we're going to Monkey Hill and that we are doing Babam Nest. So it's at this really, really high end hotel called Sri Parna, Parana? I'll tell you tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> what it's called but um it is apparently top 10 best bar in the whole world so rooftop bar you get a 360 panoramic view um of the sunset so i'm really excited for that so stay tuned check it out welcome to monkey hill we made it it's definitely not a hill it's a effing mountain it is all the way up here and I'm so happy to see some monkeys. We took a taxi from Kamala Beach, which was basically like south and then across. It took about 40 minutes, so it was a nice drive. We went through Central Pocket. They drop us off right back there, right at the edge. Maybe you see some cones. Oh my gosh, I see my first monkey. Ah. There's also a lot of stray dogs here. Hey, baby. Let's find some monkeys. I know I'll let you
that much I'm sweating? This ain't pretty. Woo! But what a walk. So we got here around three, it's now 3.30. Walked up the hill, there are no cafes. We didn't make it all the way up, but from what we've seen, it doesn't look like there's any cafes or anything up here. So bring your own water. <laughs> I think that's about it. This trip will take you like half an hour or an hour, depending on how much you love the monkeys. So the taxi guy said he'll wait for us. So we're gonna go there and then we're on our way to Baba Nest. I've been talking about it the whole time. Cannot wait. It's gonna be lit. Litty lit. Looking like Simba's, what was his name? He's like, Rafiki will show you the way. Huh? Was it Rafiki? He looks wise. Do you want in my bag? You like my bag, buddy? Sorry, you can't have it. See? Oh, you're gonna bite me. You're gonna bite my bag off. So this butterfly has been following me all the way up and down the hill. Bro, what does it want? I wonder if it really likes the, the color, my skin color or something. Or is it a poisonous one? Buddy, it's time to go, you're making me nervous. Did not see this, did not know this, but it looks like you can buy bananas and they can feed yourself. I'm just now seeing this as we're leaving. All right. You can buy nuts, you can buy bananas. I'm not sure where though, because our taxi driver dropped us off here. All right, that was Monkey Hill. paradise you have to book weeks in advance but bro it is so nice serious serious little stick of luxury the sun's like right on me right now but um so we came a little bit earlier because i thought we would be longer at monkey island monkey hill wow we came earlier here so they let us come early but they didn't serve us until five very nice staff so far. Everything's really, really luxurious. They also have people that come just to take photos here and then they leave. <laughs> so if you want to just like get a view, like get a few photos for like 10 minutes, they allow you to do that before five, um, maybe a little bit after five. Cause I'm seeing now that people are leaving that wanted to take photos, but you are allowed to swim. It is a pool surrounding the whole entire dock area. And we ordered some food, some tacos. They only have Mexican tapas, but it's more than enough for dinner. I'm gonna show you guys the sunset. I just made a realization. There's the iconic Big Buddha. That is so nice. Crazy stuff, y'all.
gonna show you the menu which you can also find online but the one cocktail that i'm getting the whole time is siam gold it is the most delicious thing i've had in a long time it's like not too sweet i've had like four already and they have mexican tapas everything that you want here we go that's the menu So when you know you've had a good vacation middle fingers are gone basically giving you an update yes check out the bananas bananas we are gonna go to a different hotel for the last two days that we're here because the hotel that we really want to go to it's called the the naka hotel there's naka resort and then naka Ho the naka hotel we're gonna go there for the last two days hyatt regency it's been cool but like I said, not completely happy with this place. We got the room with the pool. In the pool, there's no sun. No sun hits this area, so the pool kind of just stays cold. Ah, they're, they're coming to get the bags now, so we're all packed up. So now we'll show you the Naka Hotel later, yeah? Hello. Hi. I don't know so much about the Naka Hotel, but we have the one-room pool villa high bay it's called apparently they have their own beach and that's pretty much all that we read and saw i will definitely give you a tour and show you around it's gonna be quite exciting the checkout we did an early checkout so we checked out two days before um at the hyatt and they were very nice every the staff there is like so amazing all the girls that i met there hi <laughs> um very very cool people um, we asked if we can maybe get some money back because we're leaving two days earlier and yeah I mean there was even a day where I took a bath and the whole bathtub was leaking water from underneath and the whole entire bathroom was like flooded <laughs> it's not ideal to chill there it's just not really it's not up to standard and they need a lot of renovation so we tried to get the money back and they said because we booked through a travel agency there is no way that we can get a money, the money back from them but we can try and call the travel agency okay. anyways they helped us with the bags and now we're on the way i was trying to ask the the taxi driver if he knows what beach is like close to there he doesn't know either but um yeah see you there
Kitchen. Up there is the rooftop bar and spa. They have the restaurant down there where the beach is at. Yeah, this is stupid crazy, amazing. I have it all over my arms. I have it everywhere on my legs, my like chest area here. It's really bad, especially in my face. Ooh. So let's uh, not think about that and let's check out this view. This here is the room that you sleep in. Literally just sitting on a plate. I had to jump into the pool and get a beer. So everything inside of the mini bar is, you know, free. So every day they restock it. And if you want more, you just call them. So cheers to that. It's definitely an upgrade. And I'm really sad we only have two days here. <laughs> so we're gonna come back. Definitely, I hope. Shall we come to the Okay, we're gonna come back. <laughs> I don't know when, but we have to. This is like such an upgrade. Dying. Oh, we're the only ones here. two already at the Naka Hotel. We're gonna go to breakfast now. Later I wanted to go to the beach and then we're just gonna hang out by the pool at the villa upstairs. I'll bring you along, show you little clips of it. So sad it's the end, it's almost the end and then tomorrow or tonight even, I might even already have to pack. It's probably not even gonna happen. I'm just gonna refuse, refuse to do any of that.
so much expression because of the mask. <laughs> but I was just thinking, you know, it's anyways the last day. I'm going to, I'm gonna say goodbye here. I'm gonna enjoy the rest of my trip. I'm gonna pack. We're taking the flight back tomorrow morning. We're leaving around eight in the morning already. Guys, thank you for watching. I hope you guys liked it. <laughs> if I seem to be kind of all over the place, which I normally am anyways, it's probably because I just was super excited and I just was just saying things. So if something wasn't clear or if you want to know more about something or if you noticed something um, or just want to chat and say hi, please write a comment in the comment box below. See you guys. Mwah! Mm -hmm.